This is Charlie. Charlie is an outdoor charcoal oven that can do, well, pretty much anything. It's a barbecue, it's a grill, it's a smoker, it's a pizza oven, it's a bread oven, it's an oven. It can do any sort of food with amazing versatility, with amazing ease, and create fantastic restaurant quality charcoal cooked food. Let me show you how it works. Here it is, 160 kilograms of solid steel. Very, very, very simple to operate and a lovely blend of form and function. The way it works is this. We make a small pile of charcoal here, about so much, that's the technical amount, so much. Doesn't take very much charcoal at all because it's incredibly fuel efficient due to the nature of its construction and operation. We put one little natural wood wool fire lighter here, light it, shut the door, open the two air vents and that is it. That is now lit. Okay, we leave it alone. We'll see the temperature begin to rise pretty quickly. We'll see about 200 Celsius in 15 to 20 minutes. 300 Celsius in 25 to 30 minutes, and you can set it anywhere from 100 to 400 degrees, depending on the type of cooking you want to do. When you get to the temperature you want, let's say we're going for 200 degrees, just shy of there, we shut these two almost all the way in, so that there is just a tiny trickle of air. When we've lit it, the oxygen with the vents open has been drawn up through the oven, through the natural process. The charcoal heats up, heats up very quickly. We set it and when we set it, the temperature will then stay and it will hold absolutely rock solid at that temperature for hours. It's as controllable as the temperature on the oven in your kitchen at home. Because the way it works is not like a barbecue. It's almost the opposite in some ways because with a barbie, you're standing over it, blasting it from one side with intense heat and there's very little margin between burnt and raw. We're standing over it, we're flipping, we're prodding, we're poking. The Charlie oven works in a completely different way. When we're at cooking temperature, the food is being cooked primarily by the heat held in the thermal mass of the steel itself. As I say, it's 160 kilograms of solid steel and it is hugely heavily insulated. So even if you're cooking at pizza temperature at 350 degrees, you can still put your hand on the outside of the door. So when we're cooking, the temperature, the heat is cooking the food from all around in an incredibly consistent, even controlled way. Meanwhile, the charcoal is smoldering away in the bottom of the oven, giving you that fantastic charcoal flavor and sealing in the flavor, the moisture, the charcoal aroma. It's a design that originally comes from professional kitchens and it's been redesigned to work outdoors at home because the chef knows that he needs incredibly precise temperature control. It can't be wavering all over the place. He puts his lobster in there. He comes back 11 minutes, 15 seconds later. He knows that it's got to be absolutely bang on. So it makes it a very, very easy way to cook because we're always cooking with the door shut. So whether we're cooking a leg of lamb for six hours at 110 degrees or whether we're cooking a pizza for four minutes at 350 degrees, we are always cooking with the door shut to get that fantastic sealed in charcoal flavor to get that fantastically even, all round, consistent, foolproof cook. It's low maintenance, hands-off cooking. You do not need to stand over it, tending it. In it goes, shut the door, the magic of charcoal and the Charlie oven, come back when it's ready, bish bash bosh, done. What we've got inside are nine different cooking heights. Now, most of the time we're gonna be cooking by what I would describe as indirect heat. So it's that heat that's coming from the oven with the charcoal just smoldering away. However, if we want to, we can cook with direct heat as well when we can get some direct heat and flame from the charcoal itself. What we would do here is we would take one of these racks. I mean, yeah, you can just feel the weight of this. It's hugely heavily engineered. We can look at the engineering 
This is built to last. It's built to be a pleasure to use. It's built to be incredibly functional. If we're wanting to sear something, we'll put the rack right down at the bottom, near to the charcoal. We'll open up the air vents to get the charcoal smouldering away and then glowing and then burning. We'll take, let's say a steak. We want a lovely medium rare steak. On there, shut the door, minute and a half. Flip it over onto the other side, minute and a half with the door shut, comes out, rests for 10 minutes, perfect every single time. And meanwhile, what we can be doing is we can be having vegetables, corn on the cob, whatever it is, cooking on the upper racks as well. So we can cook a whole meal in one go. One of the beautiful things about this is the sheer volume of the oven. Let's say you wanted to smoke something like a salmon or a rib of beef. We can hang it from the top shelf here in this huge capacious oven which has two and a half times the volume of a standard domestic oven. When we think about the area that we've got to cook on with two racks, we've got that much cooking area. With three racks, we can feed the 5,000, we can have all our friends around, or we can do three pizzas at the same time, or we can do every element of a meal at the same time. And the lovely thing about this is that it is fantastic for cooking almost anything. So as one might expect from an outdoor cooking device like this, things like meat, of course. You know, we can always add wood to the charcoal as well to get extra smokiness. One of the lovely things about this is that you've always got access to the grates and to the charcoal, which is unlike some cooking devices, which means that there's no paraphernalia, there's no deflectors, there's no racks, there's no guards, there's no effort to put in more wood, to put in more charcoal, whatever we might need to do. But what it means is that we have the ability to cook absolutely anything. It's fantastic for things like seafood, three pizzas at the same time. Amazing for things that you might not necessarily expect like puddings, stone fruit and apple crumble. Fantastic, do your whole Christmas dinner, do the whole roast lunch, does absolutely anything, even bakes a cake. And, one of the lovely advantages of the way it cooks is that it means you can do it all year round because it's hands-off cooking. You do not need to stand over it in the pouring rain and the freezing cold. When you open the door, it's not like a top opening device, device where you lose all the heat and the rain gets on your food. In it goes, go indoors, have a nice cup of tea, use it all year round. And nearly all of our customers who have a Charlie oven tend to use it week in, week out because it is so versatile and so easy to use. And you know, if you wonder, does it last outdoors? Can you leave it outdoors? The simple answer is yes. It's designed to live and work and last outdoors indefinitely. It's 160 kilograms of steel. All of the steel that you can see on the outside is stainless, so it won't rust. All of the steel on the inside of the oven that you can see apart from the grates themselves is stainless, which makes it super easy to use, super easy to clean. The exterior is powder coated, so it's completely weatherproof. It's the same process as it is used to paint things like alloy wheels on your car. It will sit outdoors all winter. Now, of course, like your car, you might need to give it a clean with a bit of a sponge and soapy water, but that's it. In terms of cleaning the inside of the oven, as I say, it's stainless steel, which means that these grates can be cleaned with pretty much anything. They'll go in your dishwasher. You can power wash them on your patio. You can go at it with a scrubbing brush. And because it's stainless, you get much less adherence to the inside of the oven. The only real regular cleaning that needs to be done is to get rid of the ash. So the ash falls through these lower grates, through the lower air vent, and ends up in this ash pan down here. So perhaps every 10 times you've used it, not more because it's incredibly economical on fuel, and it comes, empty it in the bin, on the roses, whatever you want to do with it. And that, ladies 
and gentlemen is how you use it. The only final thing I'd like to say is that um, it's made in Britain. We make it in our factory in lovely Nottingham where we do all the fabrication and all the paint work. It means we have fantastically good control over manufacture, over quality, over process and on after sales service. All in all, it is a pleasure to use. It's a fantastic design icon that we make in 10 lovely colors to form pride of place in anybody's garden. And it transforms the way that we cook and live and eat outdoors.